There's a picture of Taylor Swift that's been going super viral on the internet that has people speculating that Taylor Swift is pregnant. Hi, OBGYN here and professional expert in the pregnancy body. And in my professional opinion, it's none of your business. That's right, it's none of your business if Taylor Swift is pregnant. I thought we as a society had agreed upon that we were not gonna comment on women's bodies. Like I thought that we had agreed upon that. If you see a woman with a little fullness in her lower abdomen, you do not ask her if she is pregnant. I thought that we agreed upon that. We as a society, if we saw someone who had like a round or abdomen, that's just their body shape, we don't ask them like if they could be pregnant. Even I as an OBGYN don't ask people if they're pregnant unless there is a baby coming out of their body. And I have this discussion with my toddlers all the time that we do not comment on other people's bodies. Just the other day, my daughter goes to me, Mommy, why is your belly bigger than my belly? Our bodies just come in different sizes. That's just how it is. We don't have to comment on it and we don't have to speculate on it. So is Taylor Swift pregnant? It's none of our business. Hey loves, welcome back to the channel. So before I enroll other stitches, it's out there that Taylor Swift is pregnant. Probably because of the video that is going viral where we see her stomach bulging and everything. But people don't understand that she's been on the stage for, you know, a long time. And a lot of things happen. Could be a food baby or something else, right? So the Swifties, this has forced the Swifties now to jump in and they're reacting. So let's get right into it. At this point in time, I would just like to say that I stand with Taylor Swift on her side. How dare you make me stand with Taylor Swift? How dare you put me on her side? How dare you put me in a position where I have to defend her? But this is where we are. People are saying she's pregnant. I don't think she's pregnant. I think it's a food baby. And I happen to have that body type that if I gain an extra pound, three extra pounds, it goes to one area and people think I'm pregnant. It sucks. It's true. So I am a very small girl. I'm very short. I don't weigh very much. And I'm very petite. I have very small bones. I just have a small frame. But I have this like curve in my back, in my lower back. It's not scoliosis, but it's a little more of a curve than most people have. So if I eat a little bit too much, if I gain any extra weight well, on top of that curve, it also will all go to that area. Everything. All of it. So now I'm just kind of a skinny person who looks pregnant. And yes, I have been asked in public several times when I was a little bit more poofy if I was pregnant. One time I was working at a restaurant as a server. So I already feel like a little life. I'm servicing you. I am your server. What can I get you? I will run and get it right now. And I was waiting on a family. It was about a family of eight kids, parents, all that. And one of the parents asked me when I, if I was pregnant and when I was due. And I was like, I'm not. And this was after I took their order when we're not discussing anything about me or my body and I have a big t-shirt on. And they asked me that and I had to tell them that. So yes, I feel the pain. And sometimes women get a little pooch in that area and it just happens. And some of us have that shape where if we gain any weight, it goes right there. And if we are full, it goes right there. It just happens. Um, I will say I did at least get a really big sympathy tip out of that table because I think they felt really sorry for me and ashamed that they asked me that question. But if you're wondering where this is coming from, people are speculating that there's articles written about this, that Taylor Swift might be pregnant because she's got a little extra in that area, even though she's extremely thin everywhere else. That doesn't always mean, and you know what? Sometimes it is kind of natural for women to have more in that area. If you think about it, that's fat, that's protecting your uterus. So there's that also. Um, yeah, it's just, it, it'll be fine. We'll all be fine. <laughs>